you have a motorcycle in your house that's a yeah that's a dirt bike yamaha 450 yr yep. <laughs> just wow <laughs> i like my background i've got a drum <laughs> but jeez well, i got wow. a, i got a I got a John Deere tractor over there. Too. Oh my God. <laughs> Where are, is that a garage? Is that inside the house? Like, well, Rena, it's a, it's a barn. It's a really big oh, uh, post and beam barn there. Look at, you can kind of see it's away from, wow. from the house. And it's uh, where nice. I store my videos and stuff and tools, but also uh, I do um, events here. The, you guys can see the stage in the corner. Ah. I have people over and I interview them. It's it's alive what you're doing. Yeah. Oh, nice. Like, yeah. Yeah. People, people, Rick Cabot, the head of Darn Tough. I just had last week the our, our Vermont's number one game warden, uh, Jason Batchelder. Just I invite 50 people. Uh, you know, it's educational. It's just kind of a fun way of getting together. Oh, nice. Wow, now cool. that you now that I see the stage, it reminds me of when I used to go to like punk rock shows in barns. <laughs> Like, that's cool as a teenager well you oh know Reed and J jason uh, and reno will be hip to this too I, I kind of thought about it like that um who was the drummer for the band died recently really cool oh. guy he would go ahead i'm trying i'm thinking oh uh levon helm oh yeah yeah levon helm had a bar barn in upstate new york and they used to practice there and then people started showing up and then they started doing these barn barn events. Kind of thought of it that way. Hmm. Yeah. yeah, it's good to have a space like that, especially in a community like like you know we have. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We're both from Vermont, in case anybody's wondering, <laughs> or live in Vermont. Right. Yeah.